University arms students with hockey pucks to defend against mass shooters. The brain trust in charge of one Michigan college thinks hockey pucks are the perfect defense against a crazed gunman. Oakland University is distributing hockey pucks to students and staff to be used in the unlikely event of a mass shooting. Presumably these hockey pucks would be thrown at someone with a real firearm, which is as dumb as it sounds. Click on Detroit reports that faculty at Oakland University in Auburn Hills, Michigan are undergoing active shooter training. This training effort was organized by the school's faculty union, the American Association of University Professors, and conducted by Oakland University Police Chief Mark Gordon. The goal is to make the campus a safer place. We believe that once faculty have been trained in what to do in an active shooter situation, they will be able to share that information with students to provide a more secure learning environment, said AAUP President Tom Diskena. That's certainly an honorable goal until the details of the training are considered, and then it's just dumb. In addition to training, the union has also distributed hockey pucks to its members and to students. According to Gordon, to fight effectively, faculty and students need to be prepared to throw objects that are heavy and will cause a distraction. Hockey pucks provide the ability to be carried in briefcases or backpacks, are not considered a weapon, and will meet the goal of distracting the shooter, according to Gordon. Currently, the union has distributed the pucks to its 800 members and is working with student groups to distribute an additional 1,700 pucks to students. So the idea is to have students and professors throw hockey pucks at a gunman who is firing live rounds? If there were an active shooting going on, the last thing anyone wants to do is throw something at the gunman as that would tend to draw attention. Ideally, the best defense would be to allow students and faculty to carry their own firearms for protection.